we learned how it actually works instead of just reading about how it works and we got to see we got to see everything and why birdhouses have to be placed on certain trees and certain heights of trees because it affects um, whether birds are attracted to them or not. Overall, we wanted to we wanted the students to do something to impact the community. We teamed up with Collin County Adventure Camp. We asked them what problem do they have or do they see um, that we could have our students try to solve. And they said that they've got a declining uh, bird, bat, and deer population in, in the Collin Grayson area. So we had our students research native Texas bats, birds, deer, and see what they could do to try to help them. They decided to make birdhouses, bat houses, and deer feeders. Every science classroom they were building, um, we had students outside, out, all out front. Um, I felt bad for the teachers around us because they were hammering, drilling, sawing. Well, we went on a field trip, and we like took a hike, and like we found the tree to, to put our birdhouses up, and bed houses and that stuff. And we learned about the plants and stuff around there. My favorite aspect was really seeing the kids do non-classroom work, especially the kids who are not good at classroom work, that you see that it's a struggle for them. They were just thriving. They were the best ones at this. 